Hi everyone, I'm Melissa with Fresh Blooming Clothing. And I'm Bear. And today we went to the Goodwill Bins. It is Monday and we got there in the afternoon and it was a little bit packed. It was a little bit packed and also I think it's fair to mention to those nice folks that are watching us all the time that the bins are a struggle once in a while for those of you who know about Melissa's health problems. It was a, a very difficult day for her there today. So, but we're glad that we went and we found some stuff and we're gonna share it with you. Yes, and we spent $21.50 and this time we worked together as a team rather than bring stuff home separately and you buy stuff you didn't know and then us just give it to our friend Linda. Yes. And I'm sure Linda might get some stuff, but with us going through it at the end, it was helpful. So do you want to start us out or do you want me to go? Sure, I'll start. Okay. We also did not separate the piles today, so Melissa got a pile of paper today. I saw this as well, but I didn't know that, I didn't know enough to pick it up. Yeah, <laughs> we go through paper a lot, even for just like scrap paper or you print songs, and there is a good bit of white paper. And I also send paper along uh, in my niece's care packages. So printer paper, awesome. Yeah. Should I go? Yes. Look how cool this is. It's like this mauve pink color, and it has one, two, three, four, five, six, six different uh, what do you call these? Utensils? Utensils, yes. Mm -hmm. And it's on a Lazy Susan, mm -hmm. and it's dirty. And this is another thing that I almost, I had in my hand. Did you? I had it in my hand, and I didn't, and then I almost took the brush out of here because I was like, oh, we'll use brush. And then I thought, well, that's silly. We have plenty of brushes at home. Then whoever gets this will have the brush that matches, and it's us. It's us! Um, it has a marking on the bottom that I'm not going to be able to show you, I don't think. But I'll type it out on the screen. And I didn't look this up. Can you? Hold on. I think it's upside down. It goes this way. Okay. Hold it right there. Now back away a little bit. That might be good. I didn't look this up, but I'll probably price this for somewhere around like 15 to $25. Unless they're going for a lot more. This is such a good color. I didn't realize it was a carousel. I know! That's I cool. keep spinning it. <laughs> so that was a fun find. I'm sure it was like a dollar. I want to know about that, so... I'm what, this thing? Yes. This is a jacket Okay. that you might steal, I have a feeling. Oh, no, I, no, no, I just didn't know what it was. <laughs> oh, I thought know. it was a raincoat or something. No, it's 511 Tactical, which is a really good brand name few things about it though it does have a company logo embroidered on it which will probably bring down the value a little bit do you recognize lock yes that's martin? a that's a air airline lockheed martin really yes but it still was in decent shape it had velcro patches on both sides of the sleeves and i don't know what what it goes to there must have been some kind of patch that went on the sleeve right uh, yeah, I would think so. Uh, but there's a lot of zippered compartments. I don't know why we need a zippered compartment on your uh, back. Not, is there possibly a hood in there? It wouldn't be high enough for the hood. The hood's well, here. It, is it possible that it's stored in there and then you take it out and, and attach it? I, I don't, I'm just yeah. guessing. No, I think it's a great guess. No, there is a giant black pocket. But is the pocket the whole things? Yeah, I think so. Oh. No. It, oh, is this open up here? Yeah, it's Velcro. Right? Yeah, it's Velcro. Oh! Oh, it, it comes off. You can take... So it's a, like a liner, make it a little bit warmer on your back. Oh! It's right here. That's isn't it. Isn't that nice of them? <laughs> <laughs> and there's pockets down the sleeves. It's, it's just got a lot going for it. It does have like a few little issues, but I think I can wash this and have it come out nice. It is a men's 3X, and this is heavy. It's $2 a pound there, so I'm guessing I probably paid like $4 for this. But if I had to guess, I could probably get $25 to $50. It's similar to the ski jacket I had. It had the pockets and the sleeves and stuff. Yeah. In the what? In the sleeves. I just said that badly. <laughs> okay. In the sleeves, uh, that, north, that north face. It's the same as that 
jacket that I had once, a ski jacket that had pockets in the sleeves. Got it. It's a North Face jacket. Okay, well we can put that somewhere. That's a heavy thing. Okay. This, I think this was just in with the cards, or with the paper. Just because, oh, it has a note. Can we read it? Sure. Dear Pat, thank you so much for your help with book club. Oh, the cake was delicious. We missed, we missed the out. cake. Pat. We all know I love cake. You made my life so much easier. I really appreciate it. Have a safe trip, Jean. Well, that was so Let's nice. See, Jean blessed that guy, and now we're blessing you. Where'd he go? Girl. Her girl, yes. Yeah, but I Same might reuse Pat. this. Yeah. Same way with Pat. Yeah, it could be a guy to a guy or a girl to yeah, it could be any. Yeah. Anything. Yes. But um, I'll probably just cut this off. I didn't even realize that was in there. But it's my colors. <laughs> You found these as well. I'll, I'll just hold these up for people. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah, I think so. And then you can say what they are. I know they are Fox brand pants. They're okay. cross country motorcycle pants. Oh. Like the guys that, you know, they do the jumps. Motocross? Motocross, yes. Motocross. Motocross pants. There and there are men's or boys 32. They were in really good shape too, right? Yes, they are. Another heavy thing though, so I'm guessing we probably paid two to three pounds for these. Did you look those up while we I didn't look them up. Mm. They just looked that well made that oh, they, yeah. I took a chance Agreed. with them. Mm -hmm. Okay, I know. Yes. Then we found these. I found these. Let me put them in order. And you're like... Which you've not done yet. Oh. <laughs> okay. Thanks. Yes. They look like little playing card books, but then when you look inside, secret pocket. Whoa. So somebody could store something in them. And they looked kind of vintagey cool. I looked them up and I didn't come up with anything. But they're, they're good, they're magnetized. Yeah, right? Those might go for like, 15 bucks? And actually, I encouraged you to get these. You did. I was going to put them back. I just thought they were cool and that surely somebody would want those. I would think so. Mm -hmm. Here's some more pants you found. These are girls' pants by Children's Place and they're the Jeggins in a size 8. My niece um, had first dibs on these, but she grew into a size 10, so I'll just sell them online. They have emojis and unicorns and smiley faces and stuff. I would probably expect to get maybe like six ninety nine to nine ninety nine plus shipping. So Jenkins is the manufacturer. No, oh. Children's Place. Jenkins is Jenkins. a style. It's like a jean legging. Oh, clever jegging, <laughs> jean legging, nice. That's my kind of advertising right there, man. Yep, and they I have like hamburgers it. on them. Again, I'm I'm all for it. Next, I found a Vera Bradley lanyard. And I've owned this print before, but I'll look it up. And I might be able to get like $4.99. And I paid a quarter. Okay, once again, this is just a clarification. This yes. Is, you said Vera. Did you say Vera Bradley or Vera? I, think, I don't know what I said. But it's Vera, <laughs> it's Vera Bradley, isn't it? Isn't it Vera Bradley? You said Vera. It's V-E-R-A. I, right. I don't know right. if it's Vera or Vera. Or Vera. Vera. I just, How do you say it? I, I, I would thought it was Vera Bradley. Vera Bradley. Vera. Not Vera Bradley. Vera Bradley. I think it's Vera. I don't know. Comment below if you know. I'll, I'll <laughs> YouTube it. Let's yeah. see. Yeah. Vera. Vera Bradley. So you're saying Vera. And I'm, you say Vera. Vera, Vera Bradley. I, I'm, just, I'm, I'm yeah. just hitting the E a little harder. Okay. Don't do that. <laughs> All right. I have no idea what this is. I had it in my hand. And she had it in her thing, and I don't know what it is. So we're going to cut it open. We have no idea what this is. I'm going to say it's just a little blanket. I'm going to say, why but, would it be? Well, because somebody like used this. one of these when they went to put it in a suitcase. And then they realized they don't need it anymore. It's just like, I'll just donate it. And it's this isn't one of the ones that goes in a suitcase. These aren't like the bags that you could suck oh, your own. Oh, this is like completely sealed. But wait a second. Don't they make machines that you can do that at home? Yes, but, but those machines usually have a zipper on them oh, okay. or like a hole somewhere. So, we have, we have, so this is like a factory sealed This thing. is a factory sealed something. Okay, cool. Yeah, the print is neat. It's like a mosaic tile. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, we're letting air into it. You want to pull it out? <laughs> I don't. Well, it's obviously soft. it's not one of those. It's very. I mean, this is just a blanket, I think, like a throw blanket you'd get in an airline or something. Ah, oh. womp womp. That's why it was sealed like oh, that. Oh, it's I pretty think. though. Look how pretty that is. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're right. I think this must be some kind of really cheaply made blanket. Yeah, just a throw for people. But but I kind of love it. The print mm -hmm. is really good. What what are we calling that print? Um, Aztec? I don't think Aztec. I, I mean, is it okay to say it reminds me of a Mexican theme? Yeah, oh, that could be. Yeah, a Mexican theme? Yeah. That's what I would say. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, interesting. Yes. Should I go? Yes. <laughs> I love this. So it's a rag rug. On one side, it just kind of looks stripey. And then on the other side, boom. It's got like all sorts of colors and patterns and somebody did an excellent job on this. It almost looks like vintage scarves have been attached. I don't know if somebody handmade it. Look at this one. This one's got like polka dots on it. Probably not, right? It's Made in India. Distributed by Five Below. Oh, okay. I think it's just a cheap thing then. Okay. Well, it reminds me of something shout out to your sister Lisa and my sister-in-law that she would make because it would take enormous amounts of work because she makes these most awesome pillowcases that are embroidered and it just takes forever but they're fantastic so it looks like like if you need another project Lisa maybe you can make a rug <laughs> maybe I could just it send take you like one. four weeks seriously I loved it though maybe I'll sell it on offer up maybe I'll put it on eBay it needs a little bit of a trim I like it I go? Oh, I think this is a good find. I found this, and I, again, most of the stuff I would have no idea unless I was her husband. <laughs> but um, I picked it up because I thought she would say this was a good find. It is. Does this go with it, you think? Uh, yes. Does it? Well, oh, what's it say inside? A little bit. In yeah, I think it does because it says low Cornell. Flip it over. Flip it over. Oh. <laughs> oh, the irony. Wait, we have to show the folks the irony. This is going to be great. Okay. She wasn't quite sure what this dummy's book was working like. <laughs> so look what happens. Ta-da! You're right. Basic draw. Okay, so it's... So cute! Mm. So cute! Okay, let's flip it up again. Okay. So, it doesn't have all of the pencils, but it looks new. The paper's new. It has, like, all of these things. What? I don't even know what some of this is. Well, that's sandpaper to make a super sharp point on your pencil. Oh, sandpaper for your in pencil. Case that, in case that uh, thing sharpener doesn't make it sharp enough. Yeah. Because this is, like, for drawing, technical drawing. Yeah. If it doesn't go for more than like 10 bucks, it might be a nice thing, but color pencils usually do pretty well. Mm -hmm. And it's got its own briefcase. It's got its own briefcase. Now again, I just want to say again, this was so much better this time because I, I picked up so much more stuff because I knew we could just go off the side and she could go through it and say rather than me pay for it and then have her tell me here. <laughs> yeah, that's no good. <laughs> okay. This is something you encouraged me to keep, and I looked this up when I was in line, yeah. and it looks like it's going for like ten to fifteen dollars. It's a jock strap. Is that well, no, it's 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 a supporter cup. It's an athlete supporter cup, so it's hard, so it's plastic. Yeah. Know? So serious athletes, I mean football players, will wear this. Okay. I mean, good some, for them. Sometimes wrestlers as well. Yeah, but it looks to be going for about fifteen dollars. It's gonna be pretty serious. I did not find this, that is yours. I found this. I think they charged me 50 cents for it, but it's a journal in like a aqua stone color. What are we calling this, like a stone wash? Yes. Yeah. And it's just lined journal. It's completely new. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. And by we, I mean I'm just agreeing with you that that's the color. Oh. <laughs> or the finish. It's like a teal, yeah. Yeah. I, I don't know. I have enough of these right now, but I can always use another one for next year. I keep all of my tax information in a book, and right now my book is purple. My mom just sent it to me, so this would have to be next year's book if I keep it. It might be given away as a gift, though. Should I go? Sure. 
I found this little uh, Cecil soap bag. You put your soap in it and it becomes like an exfoliation mitt. And it is made from the fiber of agave cactus. Okay. And it was a quarter. So in the summertime, we both like to exfoliate our skin, right? Yes. Well, I mean, you, she tells me I should do that once in a while, which is awesome, but I don't really think about that too much on my own, yeah. to tell you the truth. <laughs> <laughs> so, there we go. In spite of this wonderful specimen you see before you, <laughs> you don't think I to don't exfoliate. Think, yeah, I'm not thinking to exfoliate. Well, that's okay. All right. But for 25 cents, brand new checks. Sure, sure. sure. <laughs> should I go? Oh, here, you can, you can show that. Oh. Who out there knows what this is? You probably have to do the oh, thing okay. like this or right. it's not going to focus. Okay. That is a carpenter's pencil. And I know that because my dad used to be a carpenter for among many other things. So these are nice and flat. So when carpenters have those jean pants with that, has a roll pocket, it's proper for your folding roll. This will slide right in there because it's flat. And for folding roll, if you don't know what that means, he just means like a folding ruler. Oh, yes. <laughs> Everybody in Pennsylvania has like cute little nicknames for probably, their tools. That might have been a dad thing, I don't know. Rule. Yeah. The rule. Mm -hmm. Next is the Body Beast. And it is all of the workout CDs, DVDs, DVDs, and the literature. And I looked these up and they looked like they were going for like 25, 30 bucks. So oh. this was a good find. That's good. Yeah. This is, you know, how we did P90X that one time? Yes. It was awful. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but um, did we ever lose weight or anything? Well, you know, I've been lifting and working out all my life, so it it's wasn't true. a huge, except there was a lot more aerobics than it I was. normally do. But yeah, aside from the, li the lifting stuff, I already get. Yeah, we were doing it while working a 24 hour shift. Yeah. We'd be on call, so we would get done at like seven, eight o'clock at night and just want to crash from the day because you'd been up for 13 hours. Because you have just to get up and do the, the all over again the next day. Yeah, and if anybody pushed like a call button for an emergency, we would have to go to their rooms and call the hospital or whatever. So we were pushing ourselves hard anyway. Mm -hmm. And then to come back and do this, it was just like. Translation. My girl was much, much better than she did not. Oh, she yeah. Was, that's before she was diagnosed with CRPS. Yes. So. Yeah, but I still hated it. <laughs> well, okay, but yeah. Okay, so there's that. Can I show your... Item? Yes. If you remember from last week, we both purchased um, those tray liners for a tray that I have, which came from the bins <laughs> as well. So, but it was a plastic one, and I broke the handle. I have the handle taped, so... She got this for me today, thinking maybe we'll try this tray out for my evening festivities of eating and watching TV. Yeah, so what happens is his room, we sleep separately, if you didn't already know, so we both have our own bedrooms. It just works better for us. So he's got the big screen television in his room. He's got to come around. It's not like super far, but it is a little bit of a trek. Make food and then carry it back. And are you the- First world. <laughs> For sure. Oh, those people got to be feeling my pain out there now. This is like 20 feet probably into the kitchen from my bedroom to carry food. Oh, it's terrible. Yeah. So a tray helps. Thank you for feeling bad for me. Yes. <laughs> That's cute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And here you can do this. Oh, yes. Last thing. Well, as, as you know, I'm a guitar player. I, I'm a singer at retirement community, so I'm very blessed to be able to do that. And... For some reason, when my guitar, I, if I can't switch back from piano to guitar because some places don't have a piano, the guitar hanging on my shoulder puts my fingers to sleep. So I'm thinking maybe the strap is, I keep moving my strap around. Well, this in the bins today is exactly that. It's like you put your guitar strap through there, the Velcro it up, and now I'll have a pad. We'll see if that will help my little hand going to sleep. I'm so, I didn't even realize this was an issue for you or we would have yes. got something sooner. It's so funny, I just put it in my list on the phone of things that I need to do. Look Did for you? a guitar pad, yes. Nice. Yes, so there we go. I appreciate you're displaying it all the ways. Well, I mean, people wouldn't know what that was. Yeah, I don't even know if that's, is well, it made for a guitar? Not necessarily for a guitar. I thought it was this, a yoga pad thing, honestly. No, this okay. is specifically made for a strap, whether it be on a, whether it be on a duffel bag, okay. 
you know, or gym bag, really heavy gym bag or whatever. And that was probably a quarter, so yay us. Yes. And then you found this, and is this our last item? No, I haven't. Oh, you have, oh, you've been hiding them. No, I didn't. Know. It is a children's, it's covered in feathers. Do you see the feathers moving around? Children's uh, pirate costume. Let's see if I can zip it up. It smells like Tide. Oh, that's a good thing. Yeah, that is a really good thing. Yeah. Somebody washed it before donating it. Anything that smells good in uh, bins is a plus. <laughs> so true. <laughs> okay, so he has like a little parrot. <laughs> and it's a hat with a beard. And one hand has a hook. And then it's black velvet, which is going to need major lint rolling because because there's white feathers everywhere. But for a birthday party, like not even Chris, uh, Halloween birthday party, this is going to be great. Everybody in favor of the pirate costume say, I. <laughs> Come on. I. It's just waiting. It was. I don't see a size, but it says made to love, made to last. Oh. oh, that's sweet. Well, sure. We'll yeah. have to have you try it on. <laughs> that wouldn't even fit on my head. <laughs> Seriously, what size? How are we going to Well, it's for a little kid. It's it is. Kid, so. Jason might fit in that. <laughs> we only know one child. Only one child. He's a cool. He came to the door last night. He's like, I haven't seen you in a while. He just like knocks on the door. He's, he's six or seven. He's yeah. so cute. Yep. Then he comes and just mills about our house. I too. know. It's like his own house. Yeah. We found him hanging out in the hammock. Yeah. Like. His mom came over yeah, after him. Yeah, so she sent her yeah. daughter to us. He's been gone for like, you know, five minutes. Well, where'd he go? Where's Jason? He's in the hammock. Mm hmm <laughs> Okay. This was a good find that he found. Yeah, and again, just because I know that you get these, these are uh, electric blanket controllers. That's separate ones for, for those people who do sleep together, but like different <laughs> temperatures. Yeah. Yes. And I have definitely sold multiples of these. And I can usually get like 12 to $20. This one I'll probably get closer to the $20 mark. Whoever donated it did a really nice job of wrapping it up. What do you mean this, you mean this particular, this whole unit you'll probably get around to? Yeah. Oh, okay. I, you held that one up, I thought one was different. Oh no, I was oh. just showing that they wrapped it up. Oh, okay. And the cashier, ours doesn't go by weight for anything other than clothing and linens. Everything is just like whatever the cash register lady says. Yeah. So she said a dollar each. And I said, well, that's all one thing. One dollar for the whole thing. And she said, okay. So there's a little bit of bargaining at the bins. Well, I mean, you were right to do that. That's not necessarily bargaining. Bargaining is like, well, it's, it's going to cost you five, uh, two dollars, and you'd be like, well, I'll, if you're only going to charge me a dollar, I'll okay. take. You didn't do that. You corrected her, saying, look, yeah. those are one unit. Even yeah. though there's two, that's for one blanket. Yeah. yeah, but this one looks really nice. And usually, if the blanket is there, you can put it into the blanket and actually test it. But I'll plug this in, and I know what to look for the code and. But, but you didn't want the blanket because I definitely I, did not I, want I brought the blanket. brought the blanket to her as well. I didn't think she would. Yeah. But again, since I was could just ask her later, I brought the blanket and it controls everything. Yep, just get the controls. Mm -hmm. And uh, the last item, I, oh, this, I is one, this, this is one of my first items that I found today, is this vintage scale. And I can show you that it works when you squeeze it. It's so cool. If this was blue, this would this would be ours forever. It's so heavy, right? Isn't it like it is, it's yes. like real metal? Yes. Yeah. And it's amazing that it still works because those usually get jammed up or this. Little this is mid-century for sure. Oh yeah, that's a. I can't 60s. wait to look this up. That has to be from sixties, right? I would think. Yeah, probably fifties or sixties, and yes. I'll ship this in a flat rate box because this is what like four pounds. Oh, the irony! If we could only wait. <laughs> Whoa, how can we do that? I don't know. Okay. Do you think it's around four pounds? Probably four okay. or five pounds, yes. So that was everything we got for $21.50. I think we did really well. Yes, I think so too. Yeah, oh. I already listed everything, almost everything we got at the bins the last time. I'm feeling really good too. Oh. Nobody else is gonna know what I'm talking about, but I've just been not feeling great today and my pill just kicked in and I feel... Yes. Much better, yes. much, much better. Yes. I can tolerate a lot more when my pain level is low. When my pain level gets high, everything is just irritating, honestly. 
And when she hurts this small, my face is automatically gone. Oh, I know. <laughs> so that's okay. No, I just, I just. Yeah, so okay. now I can look back and say I had fun because I'm feeling good and it doesn't feel like my whole world is crashing in because of pain. Mm -hmm. So it was fun. <laughs> it was, yes. And what's your favorite thing? Uh, probably the last thing I should show you is the scale. I, yeah, this is really cool. I think the thing that's going to go for the most, the, it might be the scale. It might be the Body Beast uh, set. Mm -hmm. The thing we'll get the most use out of is the paper, for sure. Okay, yeah. Well, and the tray. Oh, the tray. I mean, I'll at least have to try it for a while. Yeah, if you try and like it, I'll paint it for you. Okay, well, we'll see. If, I mean, what is it? It's a... What, it's like giant pumpkins. But, but, but wait a yeah. second, is it actually... Because the back has a name on it. Does it mean anything having a name on it? Not really, no. <laughs> no famous tray makers out there? <laughs> It might have been sold at Cracker Barrel for like 20 bucks or something. Okay. It's not. And, and by the way, this particular tray is not intended for food contact. <laughs> That's what it says on the back of it. Yeah, just it's more of a decorative tray. Yeah. But you're not going to put food right on that tray. so. Well, no, I'm not going to put food right on it, yes. But I can repaint it if you didn't like it. Well, who knows? I might want that harvest theme. <laughs> Are we done? So, okay. I, I don't know what else to talk about. All right. <laughs> oh, we went swimming today. We did go swimming. It was very well. Then. We have a heated pool in our community and it's like right there. So we can just look out and see if anybody is in it anytime, which is awesome. And it's heated and I love it. Yes. And we're both really wimpy about this because <laughs> it needs to be like, we really like it to be like bath water. Like when you walk in, you, there's none of that like, oh, this is refreshing. No, no, we like it to just be no, nothing at all. So, so although we're really grateful to be able to swim in April, <laughs> it's still not the temperature that we want it to be. Yeah, it was good enough to be in it because my yeah. body was hurting. So yes. it did relieve some of that. Yes. But yes. Um, so, oh, and I went to Subway. I'm telling you all of the things <laughs> and it was really good. And I'm going to start eating even more healthier than I normally do on Friday. So stay tuned for that. Yes, and I'm excited about that because I know that when she eats really, really clean, clean, super clean, I she, eat she fairly feels, healthy. She does eat fairly healthy, but she feels better because of her disease and all yeah. the other things that she has. Certain foods. I mean, I feel bad for her that she has to eat that way because you're very limited in what you eat. But when she does, it's a little better. Yeah, for life her. does. It was. It was easier. last time. I hope it is this time as well because Thanks. you kind of let that go a little bit. Yeah. I have been eating things like uh, french fries and... Pancakes. Yeah, I had pancake yesterday. This morning. I had a pancake this morning. I made them last night. They were good. But I make real pancakes. I don't make them... I don't make like, like this pancakes. Like my pancakes like fill the plate. <laughs> They're like sweet food <laughs> if you don't know already. Okay. All right. You know what we say. <laughs> Come on, man. That. You know we're doing okay. it. Okay. Hey, uh, Barrett is coming up with a little jingle. Do you want to break out your jingle right now? No, not now. Not now? Not now. Uh, okay. Uh. So, have a good day. I hope your day has less pain and more sales. And thanks for hanging out with us. Seriously, we, we do appreciate it. That sounded so professional. Oh, well, I Thanks mean, for hanging out with us. Right. Uh, thanks I for hanging out with us. Yes. And we hope your day is blooming with joy. See ya. So when we go into the bins, we usually grab a cart or two, and this time we were lucky enough to find two, so we can sort from one cart to the next. You'll see me digging through a couple things that Bear had collected, including some cards, but I have so many cards. These were really nice. I'm thinking I might have still bought these to resell. I might have gotten a few dollars because there were so many cards and they were all in really good shape, but we left them behind. I just didn't need any more cards. And you'll see in a little bit, he also found like a Rubbermaid type bin, plastic tote bin, um, full of cards. So somebody really downsized their card collection, which is something I actually have to do at least a few times a year because I collect so many cards.
they all looked so nice, but we put this back. Next is a little briefcase with art supplies, which we did keep. And since editing this video, I took all of the supplies out and took the like plastic inserts out and we're going to give the briefcase to a neighbor's son. This was a plastic bowl. My husband likes bowls like this for um, nuking things, but plastic, we were just worried about the plastic in the microwave, so we put that back. Next is a collection of sewing items that I had found and I found these and threw them in the cart. I was hoping there were more metal zippers. <laughs> and there you can see I found a pencil um, for the art kit. Okay, so there weren't enough metal zippers to keep that. This I thought it could hold swimsuits on top of my closet or maybe like out of season clothing, but ultimately they were the right color. You, you'll notice they're the right color, which is why I picked them up, but ultimately they had a few little spots on them and I wasn't exactly sure I needed them. So those went back. It's my husband just throwing them back. He found an Adidas hat that was the Chelsea Football Club and these usually go for about like $15 but this one was really badly stained so we put that back. This Talbot's bag I had just picked up thinking we could bag all of the stuff at the end. And this is hardware Oop. <laughs> that was hardware for a, a curtain rod. So we put that back. I thought it might be brass. It wasn't. Okay, this was a caddy that we actually did buy. I loved the color. It was like this 80s dusty pink color. So we did get that. And there's the jock strap thing I picked up. Then we were going through a few things at the end, including. Um, a Hot Wheels like car elevator, which we put back, and some kind of breathing machine. Here's the breathing machine. Because it was medical equipment, I couldn't sell it. There was one actually on eBay, but that should have been pulled by now. eBay won't let you sell medical equipment if it requires a script. And this is that Hot Wheels thing. They were selling for like five bucks, wasn't worth it. Yeah. Bye. Bye.